Hey everyone, this is Andrew Tai. Welcome to my YouTube channel. So if you didn't already know, Game Porting Toolkit is a way of running a lot of Windows games on the Apple Silicon Mac, including games like Diablo 4, Cyberpunk 2077, etc. However, those are really big games, and you might want to install them on an external drive. And it's not immediately obvious how do you get external volumes to appear for Game Porting Tool on the Apple Silicon Mac, and today I'm going to show you how to do that. So I'm going to show you an example with Steam, another example with the command line as well. So first we're going to go to the Steam button here, and then go to settings and what I want to do is to go to the download section here and let's say I want to create or add a library which is on the external drive so we're going to go to downloads and then click on steam library folders and so I've got my internal drive here I press plus and then we're going to navigate to our mounted volume here but you can't really see it at the moment if we can look at this we can only see the C drive which is part of our wine prefix. So in order to do it, we need to go to the Z drive here. And then here we can see the kind of the view of the computer according to the wine prefix. So here we can go to volumes and we can see the hard drives which the wine prefix can see. And I want this one here called Windows. So I'm gonna click on Windows here and expand and you can see everything that's within this window is within this part here. So backslash Windows, that's the path that we have. And we're gonna go ahead and select our Steam library here, press select. We can see all the games that I've installed onto the Steam library of my Windows hard drive. That's all been added on there. Just press OK. So I'm just going to show you how you can do this with command line as well. And just show you, let's say I want to run a bunch of games from my external drive. Uh, we're going to go to Windows. I have a bunch of games here, which I downloaded from GOG. Let's say I want to run Cyberpunk 2077 from this. So let's say we want to take this Cyberpunk game here. So this is located, uh, if you can't see the path, you can just go to View and then click Show Path. But basically, I want to go Windows Games Cyberpunk 2077 bin x64 Cyberpunk 2077. This is the path that you want. You want to use the Game Porting Toolkit, the prefix that you have created, and then down quote Z equals volumes Windows Games Cyberpunk 2077 bin x64 Cyberpunk 2077.exe. That's the exe file we want to launch with the end quote here. Let's just press return. Showing some errors, but the game is launching. So we have Cyberpunk 2077 here. And now we have the game launched all from the terminal on an external drive. So that's all working correctly. If you need any other tips, then make sure to check out the Game Porting Toolkit article on the Apple Gaming Wiki website. So anyway, I hope you found this video useful. If you did, please like, please subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.